We are the shifty grifts. <laughs> no, we are not yet, not yet. We are not yet the shifty grifts, because he's not ready. It's gonna be loud and disgusting. So. sentence in German and that is Ein Biabete, aber ich habe kein Geld. They taught me that in Leipzig. Uh, that's the only so German typical thing I know. For you. Bass, but yeah, well, you made him feel good. 
Next one's called 52 Demons. And it's about struggling with anxiety and depression and how much it sucks. to write the playlist for today but I didn't do it
Who, who is at least a little bit drunk? A little bit drunk. He's drunk. You're a little bit drunk. You look like you're drunk all the time, man. <laughs> but you're drinking. Oh, oh, I thought that's a club mate, but it's a beer, is it? Okay, nice. No club mate in this place. <laughs> But there is the beer, which has got like two person on there or two or something. You know? That's what we are drinking. Yeah. And I'm we're really still drunk. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I'm drinking something stronger. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you're better than me then. Or whatever. Uh, <laughs> drunk. You're the bigger man. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> that is the reason why I needed a break between the shows, you know. Ah, okay. Uh, the, the next one uh, is called The Hunger, The Rent, The Hate. And then it's about how landlords fucking suck. Who lives in a fucking rent, rented place? We all fucking do. We pay a rent to people who do fucking nothing just because they own property and they make our lives miserable. So, fuck the landlords. Fuck Let's fucking hang them. <laughs> Because our old drummer went crazy and he started believing in like crystals and shit and like uh, hippie wool sh shit. And so we got this one. Um, he sucks too, but at least he doesn't believe in crystals. So. But we like him a little bit, so it's okay. Uh, next song is. Uh, oh, this song is called Deep Below and it's about dead fascists. Uh, and it's about, it's a vision of a future where all the fascists are dead. And uh, well usually I say, 
because we had our problems with like uh, you wouldn't think you have to do that, but we played gigs and there were like people who were like neo-Nazi clothes and shit. And uh, it sucks we have to say this, but like we always say we don't allow any people like that. It doesn't matter if they work security or if they work behind the bar or if they're paying customers at the at, at the venue. But we we can't allow allow people who wear fascist clothing and shit to infiltrate our gigs. So yeah, we actually canceled one gig one month ago, like just not that far away from here. Because there were fucking idiots. Close to Karlovy Vary, we just came clothes. there and there was like table full of neo-Nazi people. So, so we just say okay. But Sorry, from what I've here. seen, Germany is really good at that. You guys don't allow fascists to your concert, so good job, guys. So this one's about dead, dead Nazis. <laughs> We also have to have some fun and have some good times. This is this one is about when you are at a low point in your life and you find somebody, you might find somebody who helps out a little bit. This is for all the anti-social people who find their anti-social hull. That's how the song should have been, not anti-social heart, but anti-social hull, that would have been better. I'm gonna rewrite it.
Slow songs. This one is an, uh, based on an actual story when I was in Baltimore and it was really fucking hot, but now it's hot here in Europe too, so this is the new, nor new normal. And uh, I didn't have anywhere to sleep, but I think you can all relate. If you're somewhere in the road and you meet somebody with a t shirt or a patch of a band you know, you have a friend. That's why punks are fucking awesome. Because we have friends everywhere. This, this one is about this. one is called Broken Shards and it's about like if you imagine your life as a record as a vinyl record and like it used to sound good but the more you play the more it sucks and then it breaks and you have just little shards little pieces and you can't really put it back together for it to be able to play um, I, there's no moral to the story I just made all this shit up right here <laughs>
Thank you. I would just like to say we are really grateful for being able to play here. And it doesn't really matter to us how many people are at, at our gigs. We, we do this because we like sitting in a van and drinking and playing music. <laughs> and that's why we do it. So we don't really give a shit. So thank you for coming and thank you for having us here. The next one is a, a little bit political, maybe. I don't know if, if you're okay with politics. Uh, if you're not, just, just fuck off if you're not. Uh, this one is called Kill the Rich. I don't know, it kind of explains itself. So let's kill the rich. Let's do it. I don't need a stand, right? Like the whole show, I would say. Uh, no, I need to hold my beer. Oh, okay, okay. This is my instrument. I actually need a stand for a beer, I would say. That's a good idea. This song, this is our last song. It's called Keeping Me Sane. And it's about the thing that, keep it, that is keeping us sane, which is music. It's a, it's a tribute to all the bands that made us who we are, that are the reason why we know each other, why we make friends. And where we found our second family, it's and it's a pure love song, but it's love song about music. It's it's love about music, <laughs> whatever, whatever bullshit. It's called keeping me sane. <laughs> Get away from my own celebrity Was my teenage trying to catch Cross me 
for some fucking noise for Matze who organized this great Woo! Yes, so that's a good idea. Woo! <laughs> Too soon again. <laughs> it's the, the merch is pay as much as he wants, so we don't, we don't know the prices, so. But thank you. Thank you. 